Hello and welcome to Chili Bee Gaming. I'm Evie and today we're back with some more control as part of our Sunday Fun Day playlist. And last time we made it here to find Hartman. And I believe this is the. This might be the Eagle Limited AWE. Let's just have a look. Oh no, it's Frau. Fra Mauro. I don't know why I keep calling it Frau. Fra Mauro AWE. And there he is. Looking very. Gross. Ugh. Stinky. Alright, let's get into it. Hartman, you weirdo. Okay. Activate the lights. Are you in here? Is it in here? Oh. No? Well, do you know what? We'll read that after. I don't want to. Um... Ah, is it here? No. When you hear this, you will know. <laughs> So that moves the light? Okay. Ah. Okay. What does. So if we. Can we press it again? That'll enable us to get this. This. Oh god! Oh god! Okay, so this needs to go somewhere. But where? That's the question. Let's go with the light. Way, moving this way. To here. So that send it that way. Okay, so then I assume we need to Looks like it needs to go over there, doesn't it? Let's just zoom over here. Get back into the light. Okay. So... Oh no! But which one's the lights? Block over there, okay. So we need to get over there somehow, don't we? So that should send this forward. Over to this way, yep. Ah, there you go. Okay, so now we need to get one more block. The light's over there now, okay. Ah, oh, there you go. Good God. There. One last place for him to hide. Let me tell you, that took me ages to do. There wasn't another... Um, block. I'll show you what I did. Oh, God. It took me so long to figure out, and it's stupid that it took me so long to figure out. Basically, I had to move the block from down here to up here. 
so that that would activate the the control room up there so I could turn the lights on. Oh, but we did it, we did it, we did it at least. Good grief. Okay. Yes, hello. Oh, hello. Yes, me? Worry who? Hello? Hello. Great about us today. Long roads and no hardly. You are bygone? Uh, sure. Yeah. Why are you locked up in here? Ah, uh, casual turning. Back and front. And <laughs> Gerbil took the top head. Not being pressed for that. Lady going and loosing back for I? Sorry, I... I think I'm misunderstanding you. What do you want? The head. The head for tales. For reading news, jars, words, and tumble. The reading head. Okay, okay. Take it easy. I'll... Uh... I'll take a look. So... Maybe it wants something to read. Find what the prisoner wants. Or a jar. <laughs> okay. Good God. Okay, uh, let's just have a look. It was something to do with the gerbil's head, wasn't it? Just thinking about it. Gerbil took the top head. Find what the prisoner wants. Jesse speaks to a bureau prisoner and agrees to help find it. Something. Okay. Uh, let's just see what we can find. But well, um, let's just see. Am I in the right? Yeah, I'm in the right section. So it's something here. Oh, we need to read the other files as well, don't we? So we. We might as well do that. Okay. But at least we got rid of Hartman from here. Oh my god. That was so difficult. I couldn't figure it out. Oh, hello. Is... This could be what it wants. Let's give it a shot. Some blue roll. Okay. Uh, Fra, Marau, Mar, Mar, Fra Mauro Summary. That's what I need to learn to say. Fra Mauro AWE-7. Event Summary. A paranatural entity arrived on Earth by infiltrating the Apollo 14 lunar mission at an unknown point of their voyage to the Fra Mauro Highlands of the Moon. Event response. 32 hours after the return of the Apollo 14 command module to Earth, the Bureau was contacted by Mr. Redacted, a White House senior official, and instructed to send a small team to Johnson Space Center in Houston. At the base, the team examined the entity and carried out interviews with NASA staff. They learned that four astronauts had returned to Earth instead of the expected three. Each human crew member was insistent that the mission left with four members, though they couldn't name the fourth when asked. The entity seemingly affected their memory to make its presence feel unremarkable. The entity was transported to the oldest house for further investigation. Note, an altercation between NASA and security and the investigation team occurred upon their arrival. Mr. Redacted called to clarify the matter. Though tensions remained high, Bureau jurisdiction and clearance should be defined more clearly with other federal agencies. Hmm. I've heard of something like this before, and I think it was an SCP story. I can't remember. I know that, well, I, I think that a lot of the stuff that we find in... in control, it's kind of based upon the... Um, SCP-like stories and SCP-like entities. But, hmm, I don't know. Alright, what else we got here? Frat Morau Supplement. Frat Mauro. AWE-7. Details. The Apollo 14 entity, commonly known as Fra, underwent a series of physical examinations upon its admittance to the oldest house. The entity can speak, though its grasp of the English language makes any meaningful communication impossible. Interview material can be found at Redacted. We've already heard that, I think. Its physical form consists solely of the Extravehicular Mobility Unit, EMU spacesuit, used by NASA astronauts, the same model worn by the other crew. This could be an authentic EMU taken from one of the NASA astronauts, though this suit does not bear any wearer's name, or one materialised through redacted conversion, or possibly redacted corporealization. The suit itself is slightly damaged, which is likely due to the fact that the command module did not have a fourth seat for the entity to strap into during re-entry. The EMU is entirely hollow and pieces can be removed, though this seems to agitate the entity. X-rays and spectrograph imaging have shown redacted shaped outlines existing within the suit. For safety reasons, the entity will be contained in a secure cell unit until further until more information can be gathered. That's kind of creepy, isn't it? Just a what? 
just a um, a spacesuit with nothing in it. I've definitely heard something like this before, and it's creepy as anything. Should we give this thing the paper towels? I mean, I don't think paper towels can really do a fat lot. I don't know. Shall we? All right. Um, here you go. No, no. Jars. A head. Starch and peppers. Head. Okay, that wasn't right. Let's try something else. Something else from in here? Oh my god, what does this thing want? Well, weirdo. Maybe it's in here now. A basketball? Maybe? Maybe it'll like this. Or some fruit? Some cheese? I mean, I don't know why we're entertaining this. This seems a little bit of, I don't know. Do you want this? Nope. A -S -B -E. Let's keep trying. Maybe it's the food. Maybe it's hungry. Maybe this will do the trick. Okay. I mean, I don't know what we'll actually gain for this, but there must be something. Hey, do you want some food? Yes, that wasn't it either. Huh. Doesn't want food. Is there anything here it could want? I mean. Bloody demanding thing, isn't it? Good God. It's up here. Hmm. <sighs> Bloody thing. Jeez Louise. A head. Without giving it an actual head, I, d I don't... I can't think of anything... This thing? A toy? Oops. This might do it. A toy. Maybe. Maybe some gin or whatever that is. Okay, this is getting a little weird now. This? Lady, you are school and dirt for losing. Oh. That up and I won't help you anymore. Yeah. So watch it, dude. What does this bloody thing want? I know what it's gonna get if you don't. Let me pack it up. This? What's a drink? Let's see if this will do it. I mean, it's already got so much stuff. This. Yeah, I'm ready to be done with this as well. We've got all the stuff to do, man. Go and get rid of bloody Hartman, primarily. There. Three clocks, lady. The head. 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 No snacks. Head is top of all up and down. At the top. The top head. Wait, does this thing actually mean head? Head is in a body's head? Where the hell am I gonna find that? And how did it lose it? Yeah. I don't know about giving this thing a head, you know. It might... I don't know. It might do something weird with it. But, well... Let's, um... Let's continue on with, with Hartman's nonsense, I think. Does this... Can we, can we go this way? I don't think there's any way to go this way. Oh no, there was. There was a door up here, I think, wasn't there? Let's have a look. Good grief. Demanding swine. Get out of here. So say, well, stay in there. You're not getting a head. Be ridiculous. We don't just give away our heads for nothing. Well, service ducts. Ooh, hello. I think this is the, the greyed out area. Yes, it is. We need a light, don't we? Could we get a light from somewhere? Oh, okay. Oh, this is not good, is it? Ah, here we go. Blast it! All right, Artie. Was this what you had in mind? Ah, okay. So, ah, it's an Artie job, this one. Get rid of the goop. Is there any more this way, or was it just... There you are. There you are, have a bit of that. Eliminate the darkness. Okay. Let us continue onwards. Then we'll go and find Hartman in the other AWE. 
Can we can we get through here? Can we um let's just Okay. Didn't really mean to do that, but that's fine. Okay. I really didn't mean to do that. Observation deck. Okay. Active investigations. Oh, this is where we were before, wasn't it? Yes, it is. Right. Okay. So let's have a look. So we now. need to go to the other AWE. So let's let's just swap out our mission for what we can actually do. Find Hartman in the A the Eagle Limited AWE area. Okay. Alright. So I think that's gonna be this way. Or to our this way. Active investigations. Alright. What? We just put this down. Okay. Oof. Alright. Have we already claimed this control point? I think we have, haven't we? Yes, we have. Oh, we do have abilities, though. Two. I don't think two is going to get us very much. Melee, but we don't use melee. Three... Seize duration. We could do seize duration. Or shield barrage. Or shield strength. Um. No. We'll uh, we'll wait. Alright. Let's just um have a look. So we need to go up the lift and across. <laughs> Fine. Uh, can I have my my light, please? Okay. The light. Give me the light. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. It's just nice to have someone to talk to, you know. Oh God, here he goes. Ever since I got put in charge of the Panopticon, people treat me different. Like I'm crazy for <sighs> wanting to work with altered items. So, People just don't understand the altered items like I do, you know? I don't want to brag, but it does take a very empathetic mind to connect with the items. Doesn't Still, want I don't to know brag. why people are mm. making it so personal. Right. I mean, the teams in research handle paranatural materials every day and know what they say. Okay, so we need to go over to the Eagle Limited AWE next. Okay. I'll keep my light with me, just in case. <clears throat> There's nothing else around here. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Alright. Put that down. Go like this. It's hard to track you on all these cameras. Anyway. Still, oh. I don't know why people are making it so personal. I mean, the teams in research handle paranatural materials every day, and no one thinks they're weird. Oh, my well, friend. Well, maybe that's not true. Darling is famous for being an outlaw, but when he's weird, he's charming. Altered items really aren't that frightening once you get to know them. If you figure out what they like or don't like, you know, what sets them off, then there's nothing to worry about. I guess at the end of the day, we're still just wild animals oh, scared God. of our own okay. shadows. Claim the we're control point. to be on the same team, but sometimes it feels like it's every department for themselves. Yep. Like it's a race, and we're all trying to be number one. So, okay. If it is a race, though, I'd say Darling is a mile ahead of everyone else. He was Trench's golden boy for years, but that relationship has gotten pretty tense, or so I've heard through the grapevine. Oh, this Not looks that great. I spread rumors, just, you know. Talk. Yeah, I people like you. I keep my nose to the grind. Too much work to focus on. I need to stay focused. Oh, I'm not throwing my light away. No way. 
Okay, alright. Yep. Yeah. Let's have you. Why not? There you go. Play with your friend. Should we kill him? There we go. Okay. Gather up these Big dude getting thrown at you. Anybody else? Down here. Oh, there you are. Okay, right. Is there anything else down here? I don't think so. I think that's everything. Okay, right. Up we go. Jesse, there we go. Oh no. That was a fail. Failed. Alright. So. I am assuming we have to. Obviously get to a control room and open a door again. I think we came from there. There's nothing over that side by the looks of it. So I'm guessing it must be through here. Wow, this is bright. I don't have my light anymore. God bless it. Stairs here. Just take a little peep over this corner. Make sure that we've got everything. Yep. Alright, down we go. To this section. Ooh, man alive, it's dark in here. Hmm. Okay. It's a little spooky. Okay. We need to get that into there. Okay. And that assumedly provides power to that switch over there. Where's my light? Aha. Take that, thank you. Always wise to have a light with you because you've got goobers like that idiot who's apparently in here. You know. Okay, is there anything in here? Ooh. What's this? I assume that's going to be we can send in another. Um, oops. Another guard or something? Lovely. Thank you. Alright. Send a 
ranger out. Oh, a ranger. Director's orders. Okay. Well. Oh God Almighty! You scared the life out of me, dude. Come on. Should I put my light here? Oh, there you go. I think, um, unfortunately, my ranger popped his clogs, but, well, he thought, well, what's this? Vigorous dodge efficiency. Oh, all right. Can I take the light, please? Thank you. Yeah, I think my ranger died, which is kind of sad, but there you go. Suppose these things happen. Alright, so assumedly we need to go up. Alright, let's have a look. Up. Alright, okay. Up to there. Thank you. Got light. Okay. Oh, God. This is a little creepy. Put the light down. Okay. Brain missing. Okay. Uh, to the good for nothings at the security check. I know you took part of my brain when you put me through that metal detector. I'm not stupid. I know what they're really for. What I don't know is whether taking a part of my brain causes me to lose my memories or to lose sleep. I've been told if you lose sleep, you lose everything else too. That's where you trick us regular people. Now I don't know which it is, and I can't remember what you did to me. But I can tell you this much, I don't find this funny at all. I want my memories back, and you can be sure the next time I visit the Baltimore Washington International Thurgood Marshall Airport, I will come and find you and make you fix what you broke. Sincerely. I don't think I will be signing this with my real name. Like I said, I'm not stupid. You can just mind your own business. Where? Well. Right. Fair enough. Ah, hello. Oof. Eliminate the darkness. So there's more of the darkness here, is there? Okay. Alright. Go this way. Come on. There we go. Good God. Where is it? It's got to be here somewhere. Aha! Get out. You wretch! Anything else here? No. Well, it's still in there. Oof. Okay, ooh! Okay, didn't mean to do that, but fine. Spooky. Another light. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh. Oh. Bloody light broke. Can we pick up another one or? Oh. Good God. What on earth are these things? Ooh. Stinky. 
AC systems. Okay. Opens that ah, I see. So that different ones do different things. Hmm. All right. Well, so we can take it out of there and put it in there. No. Into there. Okay, Christ. I fell. Did the Hartman thing do all this? Oh, it's kind of stinky. So, hold on. Say okay, so different ones open different things. That's fine. Let's just have a little, uh, little look here. There we go. So, let's have a look. So the blue cables. We need one there. Ah, so to get that, we need all the red. Cables powered. Okay. I think. Ah. So two reds. So put that one in there. And then we need one that one. And then I should open this to let us get this. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but that's fine. Um, so now we need to get into... We have three, so we can open this one, can't we? So, this cable... There. That. There. Okay. That. So, this one... Here. Should open this one. Yep, there you go. There you go. This final piece. So we definitely need one there. Need one there. All the blues, basically. All the blues. There. And one there. And then we can come in here. These. Okay. Pick that up because our personal mods are full. Three and a four there. So, can we go anywhere else, or was it just purely to get the ah? Wait, can we open this? How would you suppose this one opens? So, yellow, yellow ones, right? Okay, so the yellow cables. So there, and one over here. There we go. Perfect. What's this? Reminder, the law of three also applies to all faucets within the oldest house. Be mindful and don't cause any aquatic misconduct. Thank you for your attention. Aquatic misconduct. Well, all right. Anything else in here? There you go. Service vents again. Okay.
And now you're dead. Okay. So, okay. Alright. Whoa! Go ahead. Yep. Let's claim this. Perfect. And we are going to leave it there for today, folks. Next time we will head into the Eagle Limited AWE area and um, do Hartman in because we've had enough of him. He's a pain and he's killing people and being horrible about it. So, well, not that there's really a good way you can be about it. There you are. I don't, I don't know. Anyway, until next time, be safe, be good, and look after yourself.